So I heard you got a question. So I heard you got a question. So I heard you got a question. So this is my new YouTube channel. My name is Liza and pretty much I'm answering questions from my perspective and recording it pretty much. And if you got any questions, you can leave comments below and you can ask me and I can see if I can make a video if I actually do know the answer to your question. And I'm just going to have fun. I'm very energetic, outgoing. So, if you want to stay around for the last and <laughs> Okay, so my first question that most people ask me about is my flexi rod curls i usually do flexi rod curls there's not like a real schedule that i stick to but those are the type of curls that i commonly get comments on pretty much i use any size that i want um they're a dollar these probably were a dollar fifty these were a dollar so and as you can see they've been through a lot because i use them a lot but pretty much these are the flexi rods that I use. I don't have to use many. Um, what happens is I do like big curls and then run my fingers through them. You're going to see that throughout the video. And yeah. So you're pretty much going to need a brush. Um, you can use a thinner comb. This is not the best comb. And as you can see, it's kind of broke. But... It's going to work because this is what I want to use, period. I use a clip so when I part my hair and hold one part. The cream that I use is the Natural Curl Defining Cream from Edwin Body Works. It's kind of been through a lot because I had it for a while. But it's great to lock in moisture and humidity resistance. As you can see, my hair is really frizzy, naturally frizzy. And this is medium hold. So, I don't put a lot. I just put a little bit because sometimes the cream can um, weigh your hair down. And it causes you to, like, have, like, wave instead of curls. So, yeah. that You don't want that. So, just use a decent amount. I'm going to show you throughout the video, but I'm going to tell you. And then the Goddess Curls, the gel. This is really good because it has no sulfate, silicones artificial oils colors or fragrances so anything that is bad for your hair doesn't have this is a really good product personally i only put this at the ends because i don't want my hair to get dry and this locks in moisture um it's frizz fighting um certified organic mango shea butter and plumera flower extract so, and it helps for damage hair and adds moisture. So, this is really good to put in your hair while you're doing curls. And even after you do, put a little bit, like, just to refresh them. It's a really good product and I really do like it. I usually do more towards the front than the back because the front is what more people are going to see. So, first you open your product. And kind of just... Take your finger, separate it. Um, you can hold this part right here. I'm trying to get closer so you guys can see. And I just take a decent amount, not much. Apply it mostly to your ends because your ends is what are usually like the worst part. And then for the gel, only take a little bit, a little bit. Tiny, tiny bit. I don't know if you see it. A tiny, tiny bit. Like that much. I'm trying to show you again. And you apply it to the whole thing. Take your flexi rods. Now, depending on the way you want your curl to look, if you want it to go this way, you wrap it around this way. If you want it to curl outwards, you wrap it around that way. So, personally, I like my curls to turn outwards. 
away from my face. So I comb it through as best as possible. And boom. And once you get it, just twist it. And if you can see it, that's how it looks. Nice and tight. Make sure it's locked in there. You got what I'm saying? Then the other part. Oh. Then the other part, do the same thing. A little bit of gel. If you want, you can curl them different ways and have like some curls facing towards you, some curls facing away from you. Personally, that's not what I like. However, like I said, you style your hair to your desire, not to other people's desires. So, you can even put the cream and the gel in, like, the big part and put it all together so that when you separate them, you don't got to put it separately. You just got to remember you're doing it to more hair, so you're going to need more product. Take it. Oops, sorry guys. You take it. I always make sure my ends have a lot because my ends are usually the worst part, as well as the part that doesn't. So, take the gel and just put it through. So, boom. This is how I did it. If I had more, I probably would have did more. But overall, this is how they came out. Put a bonnet on to go to sleep. And then when I wake up, I'll show you how the finished product. And now we're back. After waking up with your flexi rods after you slept for 24 hours, you take them out. I usually put like something over my head. I said I wear a bonnet. I actually wore a net. Usually you wear these when you get like a your hair done and you get a doobie and stuff like that. Sometimes they can get stuck in these things. So I'll just take that first thing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Please comment down below and subscribe to my channel. Please comment down below and subscribe to my channel. Please comment down below and subscribe to my channel. Please comment down below and subscribe to my channel. I'm done pull. And then I'm gonna open them up usually. So I'll do this one first. And that's what I said by I parted big because I opened them up anyway. So doesn't matter. <clears throat> If I, if I had parted them smaller, I wouldn't open them up. Personally, that's me. So I'm gonna open them all up and then I'll be right back. And this is the finished product. After opening them all up, I start to fluff it out. I even get a pick and just do it at the roots. I don't try to pick my hair out too much because my hair is gonna be fluffed out anyway. My hair gets fluffy naturally. But this is me opening up all of the twists, all the flexi rod twists. The back is a little bit more frizzy, but for the most part, the all came out really well and nice and curly. I usually leave my front ones hanging down right above my eyes because this is how I style my hair. But you could have styled it however you want. You could part it to the side and wear them to the side or wear more of one side to the left or the right. But it's up to you. And that's it. That's a simple, easy, flexi raw curls. Cute. You're looking pretty. And that's it. Hope you enjoyed.